everybody happy valentine so i am back with another weekly vlog and it's actually valentine's day today so i've actually spent half the day with scott until i had to go to work so i basically dropped him off oh my god he's forgot his aftershave <laughs> he's forgot his aftershave <laughs> yeah but basically i dropped him off into town because he was actually getting the train home because you won't actually know but basically he came through here on Saturday and then I was going to be going where to stay off at his on Sunday but instead of going back in his two cars I just went back in his car so he took me back and then he stayed here on Sunday night because obviously it's Monday now and then I dropped him off into town and like he got some lunch before he went because like he, he got some food in the market and um it, it was like this Asian restaurant and he said it was really nice. Like he had it on the train because it was taking a while to cook. Like he had to run to the train apparently. So I can imagine that was quite funny to watch. But anyway, but yes, basically I've taken my eyelashes off because I just have really sore eyes. Yeah, this usually happens on a Monday. I don't know why. I've not had my glasses on today. And speaking of glasses, I left in my main pair of glasses at Scott's house. So I do have a spare pair. And thank God I do because I can literally like not they've got my glasses i don't even know where i've put them now guys honestly i'm literally so forgetful at the moment but basically for valentine's day scott had got me some flowers honestly so lovely of him i will show you them and he also got me like a lovely card which i'll also show you as well yeah and i'm also wearing pink eyeshadow for valentine's because you know it's valentine's day and people in work will actually compliment me on my eye makeup so i was like oh thank you yeah so i finished work at five and oh my god it has gotten so light like lately i remember a few weeks ago at five o'clock it was pitch black but now it isn't yeah i've also been using this a peaches and cream a watermelon pigment honestly obsessed with uh, peaches and cream pigments yeah the best but yeah i'm going to show you all my beautiful flowers and my lovely little card yeah so here are, here are the beautiful flowers i have them on flash because you know, the light is really bad but basically he got me there's some flowers by the flowers by <laughs> Annabelle Rose. You follow her on Instagram. I'll put her Instagram on the screen. Honestly, she makes the most beautiful bouquets, dried or fresh flowers. I like a few little red bunny tails in there. I absolutely love bunny tails. So there's some roses. There's some, I forgot what they're called. I, I can't remember some the eucalyptus. This is, I'm pretty sure he said it's a Japanese lily or asian lily or something like that i believe but yeah how cool is that but yeah these flowers are beautiful love them also got me this lovely little card i honestly love this photo of us to even though his hands are literally so huge the size of my the size of my waist but yeah that was from his birthday it says so glad i was right about you because we met on tinder happy valentine's day so cute yeah and he also got me some biscuits as well but I kind of had them all yesterday. I'll put a photo on the screen if I still have a photo of them. But yeah, they're really nice. It's definitely a good biscuit and cake maker. And just, yeah, it's amazing. So yeah, but anyway, I'm going to see my PJs. The tea is going to be a half six, so I have to wear an hour. I did have, I did have some little brownie bites. Did that in my mouth, Charlotte from Scott. And oh my God, they're unreal. But yeah, for now i'm just gonna export some footage onto my laptop because i literally have a lot of footage which i need to edit it's just like a lot is going on right now so yes i've got a lot to do right now but yeah i'm on a roll with everything good morning everybody so it's now tuesday honestly i feel so tired i've done my makeup again because my skin is actually really spotty so i'm just kind of just using some makeup up i've just been using the Rimmel foundation actually and it is really nice but yes I was about to straighten my hair I mean it, it does look pretty straight but it'll often get wavy throughout the day and I'm also waiting on a parcel honestly almost every vlog I'm waiting on a parcel but I've ordered I've ordered a few things from ISO Clean if you don't know what ISO Clean is it's basically a makeup brush a cleaning stuff um and it's what I use to safely clean all of my makeup brushes for myself and my clients. So yeah, but I'm just need to get my hair straightened out. Honestly, who else hates it when they get tangled in the like in with other things? Because that is annoying. Right, I've got them. Yeah. So he said 
it was really precise it'll get delivered between 10 57 and 11 57 but like why not like 10 to or 5 to i don't know yeah very very precise anyway but yeah the dirty tan me again because i did tan recently i mean it is starting to go like a bit patchy on me i, pr I should probably wash it off tomorrow morning yeah well, not tomorrow morning actually because i won't finish work until well it depends yeah, tomorrow i'm actually moving into another room in the salon where i'm working i think i might have mentioned in last week's vlog but basically yeah because i'm offering more advanced treatments now like facial massage i need more space to kind of work and store all of my belongings so on wednesday me and scott hopefully if not it'll be me and my mum it's gonna be moving all of the furniture into the room i mean i only have a beauty bed a makeup chair a desk and a stool and like a ring light but the only thing is the desk is a really awkward thing to move because ikea furniture it's not the best for moving so hopefully i'll be able to get it moved and sorted um and then i'll have a bigger room to myself really which i'm looking forward to i'm hoping it's all going to work out it is slightly more in rent but obviously it's like a room i was just like in like a corridor at the back of the salon but yeah i sort his hair out these hair straight the smell of burning which isn't a good sign but yeah for now i'm just gonna get ready to go to work i'll be leaving in around 25 minutes who else who likes these the glasses i've got on i don't want to actually face the light because all you can see is my phone but basically i left my other glasses at scott's house so i have these on and to be honest i think i fairly suit them they're just a bigger and round compared to like the other ones like the other ones are more square but i think <laughs> i'm trying to make the lighting perfect but isn't yeah I, I, eh, not bad either. my mum and sister have just come home they're from newcastle and yeah, they've got me it's some pages so it's like this little tie-dye a multicolored top oh my god the material is so nice they're too excess because like it's like a bigger uh top and that was four pounds and then yeah, they've got me yeah, these really cute like, greeny uh pj bottoms yeah two excess again four pounds honestly yeah these are so nice and these are from Primark, by the way oh my god so nice and soft and how cute you'll those be together and also got some mini eggs i'm well chuffed with them i'll definitely be wearing these peaches very soon when it just kind of warm up a bit i mean to be honest i have been wearing the short peaches now because i've been getting really hot like when i've been asleep so i might even wear these tonight who knows but yeah oh my god so soft and it had loads of other colors apparently but yeah so nice so thank you mum and dad i think yeah thank you mum and bon i mean i'm just watching emily I mean, Charlie's, I think, that's, I think that's what you call her, yeah. But yeah, Bonnie's done well. She's got some PJs and like a little tote bag. Oh, who else absolutely loves the mini eggs because yeah, they smell so good and they also taste so good. This is the room so far. I've got the beauty beds. Like, obviously, I'm not keeping with this kind of shelf unit because it's already here, but I don't really want that. This is my desk. I'm going to be moving the bits and things about. I'm, I'm thinking of getting something kind of florally to go on this wall or maybe this wall but this is like a bigger wall this is like the sink area i've got a makeup chair the ring light is it kettle now? Are you gonna i know yeah coming on on kettle and everything yeah but so far this is what it looks like i've got like all my extra bits in here that been okay there yeah it's got bits and bobs yeah, some they're very random bits as well. A brush. So I might need one, yeah. Two pounds from me, though. I think we're a bit of a trip to the shops, but yeah, so far, so good. So I'm just going to take some photos, send them to my mum and dad. Yeah, these aren't mine, by the way, but yeah, very good. He basically went into town and they're basically trying to have a look for like some decoration bits for the room in the salon because it's obviously not all decorated and finished i mean i do have all my furniture in but 
I just want to add some finishing touches. I may be thinking of a flower wall maybe or something with my logo on, but I'm not too sure. But we'll wait and see anyway because I do have a lot of space in that room. So it does look bare, but I think it's because it's a bigger room, the more space. Yeah, the walls just look really bare. But anyway, I went to Wilco's and got this a lovely plant pot for £6 because I'm actually going to be repotting some of my plants soon because a lot of them are they're growing out of their like old pots and stuff so I got this one it's actually really nice it's like I think a nudie one and it's got actually found this in you so thank you oh I I only initiated <laughs> the conversation you're always helping me out with stuff but yes it's really nice I'm sweet oh, oh yeah and then we also got so ahead. also uh, from Wilco's because it's from the Wilco's we've got a half I was going to say that the half no pick and mix i mean a half price a pick and mix and it was okay but you, you can just tell if the sweets are they're not as nice as it's like the ones you get from cakes you crave horrible aren't they <laughs> no but like the, the candy king ones are really nice and scott has obviously helped me with packing everything away like they're not packing everything away and moving all my furniture into the room so thank you very much i need a strong man like you in my life to help me like guide me through life and then from primark he does for <laughs> the one of my old the work colleagues actually served me because she works in Primark now, so hi Beth. But anyway, basically, she I don't know, I, I wouldn't say so, but anyway, if you are, hello Beth. Um, basically, in Primark, I saw these last week and I was like, oh my god, they're really nice. So, for the salon, hopefully, if they obviously work, I got some indoor 25. LED lights and they basically and people call them the, the raindrop lights because like they hang down on the wall. Um and I got the two packs, one fifty each, that was three pounds for both of them. They're meant to look like that. I'm hoping it'll work out okay. You need two batteries. It says two point six meters, but we'll wait and see. Yeah, they don't drop you can force them to drop down. Yeah. I've seen them on, on Instagram and, and YouTube videos and stuff and they also look really nice. No, it's called a shower light. Shower, isn't it? Because it's a shower. Oh, I don't know. If there's not enough there, I can always get some more because, like, they're always pretty. Yeah, just a length. Cheap. You'd have to do this and then down again, up and down again. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I you can always take them back. Yeah, but mm. I think it's best to test them out because I'm sure. Amazon sell them or something and like it's like the full strip of them and yeah, the purposely made this isn't a strip with loads of them down it's just just a strip yeah it, it might still work though just because on the photo they look like that and I thought well yeah they hang down but anyway then I also got some of my favourite eyelash glue it is the the duo lash glue it's the other quick set the one and it does it make my eye lid go a bit funny but you can never get hold of the normal duo glue so that's why I have to go for this one but it is really good it's the long lasting and water resistant as it says and it's a clear one because the black one just smudges all over your eyelids and it's no good so that was five pounds I think I don't even know how much it's quite expensive glue but it's the best glue like it is PDA glue no and then finally I got a couple of so the ATP the rediffusers because oh, they, they are really good actually. I've had these before. I've got a refresh one and a peony one and for ATP. They're oh. just really nice to have like in your bedroom or your what else was I gonna say? Salon. The salon of course. Have you used the thing I got here? Yeah, the diffuser. No. What? The one that hangs up in your wardrobe. Oh yeah, I have it's actually in my wardrobe at the moment. It isn't. It is. But yeah, I'm going to be actually starting off in my new room on Friday. So that's exciting. If I didn't have any clients, I would have come through. Aye. I bet you wouldn't expect a free treatment. We all know how that works. Free cakes, free facials and massages. And eyebrow waxing. You don't get free cakes. I do. You do. But I, I get the scraps. But yeah. Happy with my little buys. As you can see, it, the my skin is very pink and it's shiny because I've done my skincare and also exfoliated. Honestly, I think my skin is having like a crisis right now. I've decided not to put any makeup on because I can't bother. But my room's all clean. 
<laughs> I love having a freshly made bed and like a lovely nice clean bedding. You feel as if it's like they're going into like a hotel bed, that's how I feel like anyway. But yeah, I've got some mini eggs because mum got me some the other day. These are honestly a 10 out of 10. Like, yeah, this is amazing. So I'm gonna sit here with a glass of water. My mini eggs, of course, on my laptop and do some editing because I am overdue editing. Like, I do have videos scheduled two weeks in advance, but that's not enough for me right now. I'm going to put my specs on as well. Oh, yeah, I did actually... Oh, yeah, it basically got... They it, it took these back through to me because I left them at his, so I do have another spare pair, but I think I just prefer these. I'm looking a bit better today. I've been working this morning. I'm going back down at half twelve because... I was basically meant to have a mobile makeup appointment and sometimes clients can mess you about a bit and it, it did not go ahead but I'm not going to let that ruin my day because you know I've been able to get some new clients this week I'm I'm feeling very positive I am also going to be missing the DPD delivery for my leaflets which are arriving today because I ordered them the other day they're actually arriving pretty quickly I'm very happy about that but anyway, so yeah, I'm now just waiting. I've left my lunch at uh, the shop, so I'm going to go down and have my lunch. But honestly, my new room is amazing. I will show you guys my new room. I love it so much. It's honestly great for what I'm doing now, like offering massages, facials and stuff. It's so spacious. I can actually move around. Yeah, it's brilliant. So for that, I love it. <laughs> the inside route, it's looking really chunky, but you know what, I can't be bothered. I really can't be bothered with it. And my eyebrows, they go through stages where they'll go really thick, thinner, thick, thinner. But yeah, I'm just embracing it. Also, my funky jumper on today because it's, it's really cool. PLT. The mum got me it for Christmas on my birthday. I can never remember. But yeah, I'm just going to brush my hair. Yeah. I've had a good morning this morning. It's now time to just I'm prepare myself for the afternoon now i think i've got four clients this afternoon so i'm looking forward to that anyway i've just come home to two massive boxes full of flyers oh my god but this one is super heavy this one is still really heavy but not as heavy as this one yeah my sister actually had a struggle trying to get this in the house but basically Oh my god, they look so good. They actually look amazing. I just want to cover my phone number, but look at them. Oh my god, they look so good. <gasps> I'm really happy with these now. Oh my god, I'm actually really happy. Like, that's really good. Oh my god, I'm really happy. How good do these they look? Obviously, the plastic is over, the, over them. That's my cousin, by the way, and that's me. But yeah, it is so good and i have about a hundred of these i have hundreds <laughs> well thousands to be exact i have thousands of them <laughs> yeah two boxes full definitely more than enough in case anybody is wondering where i got them from i got them from the company instant prints and i ordered them in the size a5 silk like a silk kind of feel to them um and I ordered 3,000. <laughs> it's probably a bit extreme, but it's because I'm going to push them through people's doors. Um, and basically, um, I think with postage and VAT included, it comes to £66 something, which is really good considering I ordered 3,000. Because, like, all the places we're charging triple that. I'm not even joking, triple plus postage. Um, instant prints, highly recommend. A, really good quality this is not an ad uh, by any means but i do really like them so i'm chuffed i am really happy with that so my diffuser has arrived it's the neon the one i actually got this from look fantastic and i managed to save 19 pounds so instead of being 129 pounds it was 110 which is obviously a lot of money but it's a good make and it comes in beautiful packaging it did come in that as well. Like, it's actually so pretty. I have already opened it, but it's really nice. Um, I've never actually heard this brand until yesterday. But, take it out of the, like, 
we take the lid off this is what it looks like it's actually so stunning look how nice that is like it's gonna look so nice in my room it's got like a little guide and stuff it's it basically used like essential oils it's got a remote <laughs> That is so cool. I think I'll have to get some batteries for that. So yes, guys, I'm really happy with this. Honestly, it's it probably the nicest diffuser I've uh, ever seen. It obviously is a lot of money. This diffuser was the deluxe edition, so it's obviously the bigger one, like the biggest one. Um, it does have a remote control. Um, Amy and my mum are actually going to be nipping into town. Let's get some bits. They like some new essential oils for the salon. Also, there probably some batteries for this <laughs> as well now. But yeah, oh my god, look how cute that is. And like, it's honestly so nice. I think it's probably made out of some sort of like stone or something, I think. But yeah, it's really good quality. It is really good quality. I was trying to figure out how you take this out because I don't really know. All right, I've, I've got this now. Oh my god, it actually has a battery in it. That's quite cool. That's good how it's got a battery in it because I mean, if you're paying a lot of money for stuff, you obviously want to expect something to come with it. But I'm now home from the shops. Honestly, my shoulder, only the one shoulder, is actually aching. Like I'm just trying to massage it. It's so sore. I also have like my little cute scrunchie on from Alter Hair Extensions. Alter Hair, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, basically went into town. I brought this massive TK Maxx bag, and it actually did. It actually did come in really handy because my mum basically did buy a lot of stuff. Like, yeah, basically the main reason why I went into the into town is because I needed some essential oils. Honestly, TK Maxx was amazing for them, so I just grabbed them out. <laughs> I think I got. Wait a minute, I think I've got six or seven essential oils. Yeah, I did. But yes, basically, the other day I saw this pack of the three in TK Maxx for £7.99. It's called the Perfect Night Inn. It's like a Valentine's edition, so it's got Smell the Roses, Sugar and Spice and Cozy Night Inn. And it's like the Valentine's Day scent, but it actually smells really nice, so it's... A geranium and orange, uh, cinnamon and clove, and a petted grain and black pepper. Smell unbelievable. Nice pair for diffusers, and this is by the brand Tissy Rand. So you will see me using my new diffuser, even though I don't know where it's gone actually. It's somewhere in my room. I keep losing the box, I don't know where it is. But yeah, I'm basically going to be using these in there, and this brand is really good. Scott has them. Then I think I've got. I I do already have this scent here, which is from Scott. It's by the brand Heggy Heggy, and it's the Basil and Mandarin one. I, and I just smell really nice. Um, and that is actually used in my own diffuser at home. How cute is that? Very cute. Um, yes, yeah, so that's the one I've got at home. I I did get. It's the same brand as I do have here called Uplift. So this is basically the scent Lemongrass and Horwood. I used to smell very sparry. That was three ninety nine just for the one. So if you compare it to this pack of three, this isn't as a good deal. But honestly, it still smell really nice. And essential oils do help to help you calm, relax. Oh, that just smell nice. Yeah, they're all very different, unique scents, but the smell amazing. If you notice, you must start it's kind of coming back. I don't know why it is. I think I'll just go through stages where it'll completely go for like a few weeks and it'll come back. And yeah, and then I got these two Doctor Botanical ones. For the RIP of these, meant you forty pounds each. I don't know how true that is, but I got them both for three ninety nine each. So I got. The lavender because it's just a classic uh, Roman therapy scent and this is actually really cool because it's like a little droplet one and now this just smell very lavendery then i also got the bergamot same price again look at them 
and it smells they're very sparry as well but i like how you can drop these in each brand of diffuser oils obviously have a different instructions on how much you need to put in in each like diffuser thing if you know what i mean but the muslim are three to five the drops but yeah but i think for 19.96 pounds that is really good because i was actually having a look at them online and for one it was going to be like 15 pounds so i've definitely saved a good chunk of money 100 percent and i'm definitely going to be taking these down to the salon so i'm all stocked up on all of these lovely things then also from the shop i went to home bargains because i was trying to look for those face masks i love that didn't have any so i came out with a hairbrush i do already have this hairbrush it is made out of bamboo as you can see oh my god the color difference that is crazy but i'm now going to start cleaning my hairbrushes i should have done this ages ago but i haven't but basically this hairbrush is really good paddle brushes are perfect for my hair and it's obviously made out of bamboo which is biodegradable and it's just it's better for the planet and it is a good sturdy hairbrush and when my old one is getting washed i'll use this and when it's in the need for a wash i'll use the other one because your hairbrush can make your hair greasy without you knowing so it's definitely a good to have two hairbrushes and these are the best you know i've just got to have spares then in poundland we've actually got me some galaxy counters i've not had these in years and i prefer them off the minstrels because they're nice and soft so they were 125 yeah like everything's gone up by 25 percent hasn't it it's quite bad then mum got me some the cookies from tesco i'm actually gonna have the one of these before i go because we're gonna be basically pushing parcels they're not parcels flyers through people's doors so i'm gonna have one of these tesco finest cookies absolutely to die for so yeah that's what i'm gonna have right now um before we leave it actually is getting really cold outside so yeah it was gonna drop some flyers off in the local area of the salon because obviously local people obviously could be a bit well hopefully there'll be more loyal to you me and the mother are now going to deliver some flyers now i've got my hat on this is the only hat that actually fits my head all right Lee. i do have quite a small head it is really nice i do like it i feel like i look like a bit of a skater person but you know what it's all right isn't it it ain't bad it ain't bad it could be worse i'm having an alcoholic beverage tonight i would never really drink i'm also drinking scots because we sometimes go some places but i probably drink once or twice a month at the most like two days a month like two or three days a month i'd say yeah, what i've got here is passion fruit vodka because i got that for my birthday it is really nice I've got the fresh orange juice and I've got a bit of like a margarita syrup. syrup. It's like a cocktail syrup in case you don't know what it is. But it is fairly nice. You know? But I'm going to be packing for Scots. Oh my god. I need to spill that then. I'm going to be packing for Scots for tomorrow because I'm, I'm actually staying over at his tomorrow. So it is Saturday today. But because I've been busy doing like the businessy stuff and getting some bits of time, I've not obviously went to his house. But i'm gonna be going in the morning i never really get to his in the morning because whenever i go to his it's always after work or yeah well yeah after work really so it'll be nice to actually go to his house i want to have a bath guys but before i obviously get in the bath i rarely ever have baths by the way but i'm just treating myself because i still have a bit of my christmas things left over so i i used some of my candy cane bubble bath from christmas of scott i think now i am going to be using this bath bomb i got off his parents it's like a little horse and carriage type thing a little princess one that's what i am so <laughs> i'm just gonna put it in the candy cane bubble bath it smells minty obviously because it's a, a mini bath bomb i've also got a couple of candles going i'm obviously going to switch the lights off you don't have the bath and then i'm using my snow fairy shower gel because again it's from christmas i've actually finished my 
the grapefruit shower gel so i'm now on to the snow fairy which i love but yeah this bath bomb is looking cute it's gonna be lovely in pink though isn't it it actually smells really nice i'm also gonna give my legs a bit of an exfoliation as well yeah but my whole body because i'm in need of scrubbing all tan off as you can tell my hands are looking very weird and this scrub is lovely and gentle but does it work wonders on your skin so i'm using these very two pink products for the bath and a very pink bath so i'm happy with that i'm out of the bath i feel very relaxed i'll be massaging my shoulders in the bath because oh my god they're so beautiful like ow but i now feel very relaxed shoulders feel great now i i want to relax myself more by using my little diffuser so i've actually filled up some water it's actually over the maximum line i'm hoping it'll be okay but i'm basically just gonna add some of my essential oil in the scent renew the basil and the mandarin this stuff is really good and it's got to be this for uh, my there's no christmas i think but yeah i'm just gonna put this in few drops i think i put a bit too many in there but i'm now going to plug it in on slew this it will send me to sleep it, it is she will it's such like a good size for my bedroom as well i need to find like the little pink thing to go on top of it here it is here it is i'm going to put this on top of there then i'm just gonna find the attachment and plug it in so if i move you all here i'm just gonna keep this on continuous there we go now i'm just gonna relax <laughs> yeah, what are we having for uh, tea no yeah, i want to teach on. you how to cook yeah you know yeah cook. yeah you'll teach me how to cook yeah come on. Look, come on then. right right pan on please okay pan on I don't know how to cook. What are you doing it onto a number six one? I don't know. You want it on the highest heat, get that colour and the flavour in. Okay, and when that's right. hot, you don't put oil in while it's heating up, you put the oil in after it's hot. Okay. So it doesn't burn. So I'm making mince dumplings, mashed potato, like vegetables, like it's Sunday, so I'm like, it's something more Sunday dinnerish. And then, right, to peel an onion, you don't just go and peel it. You do that. Yep. Yeah. Ends off. Yeah. Cut it in half. And you do this. Oh, clever. Oh, that's very clever. Uh, well, you didn't know that. Uh, well, I kind of did. You okay. didn't. Onion, so the both sides. Yeah, wash your fingers. And then the other side. And then through the middle. Yeah. Oh, this knife is very big. Then. It's sharp, but you look like you're not. I can't. Uh, oh, this can make your eyes walk, can't it? I'm going to get on a roll, onions and garlic. I'm going to do the leek and Daisy's coming through. Come on then. Oh, oh good girl. Oh, yeah. Sit on your mat. Sit on there. Look on your sit. Paw. Daisy, paw. 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 You yeah, look, I did the hair today, by the way. Look how cute she looks. You can say hi to everyone. Oh no, shit and the things, but yeah, the beef Sorry. is getting there, but yes, it's done. done. In which way do it go like that? Uh, cut it in half first, lengthways, lengthways. Oh, okay. I am not a good cook. Yeah, well, I am not a mind to it, but... That oh yeah, and then... Cut the two ends, the other ends off. Yeah. I love you for the candy. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Okay, this way. More oil in the hot pan. More oil. More oil. And then we fry the onions. Where's the hair in that? Where's it yours? Yeah, is your hair. I'm a hair tie back as well, actually, so don't be mad. No, I'm happy with that. Right. No, it adds the flavour, doesn't it, really? So. Yeah. Right. I'm cutting it That's all right. good. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you put, your, put these back. No. Like this? Yeah. Yeah, like that. I feel like I'm, I can't do problems with it like that. No, but it's safer. You're cutting the leeks. 
So I, I am back home. I basically feel so tired because I've been working. If you can see a bit of like a clear mist or like a noise of water, I basically have the my diffuser on. I'm just leaning against my phone because it's easier. But basically, yeah, I'm home. I was working this morning. Honestly, me and Scott, they could not get to sleep last night. I don't know why. So I do look really tired, but I'm now home. It is the start of a new weekly vlog, so I am going to have I'm gonna get on with some editing because you know the YouTube never stops. It's just the, the continuous cycle of getting videos out. Honestly, I love it. Like I'm really excited. I do have a very good week this week. I'm hopefully gonna be filming a very exciting video, which I've never filmed before. I mean, Scott, I've been wanting to film it for ages. So please watch out for that. But yeah, if you guys have enjoyed this weekly vlog, please make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below, also subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye for